Delta has formed in the Caribbean. Forecasters say it could become a major hurricane Wednesday morning as it moves into the Gulf. We are your hurricane headquarters and we're closely watching this strengthening storm. This is a storm that could eventually make landfall, say, along the Louisiana coast. Chief Meteorologist Patrick Vaughn is with us from the Storm Tracker Center tonight. Sir, I know the new forecast just came down. And uh, the good news is that for us, at least, not much has changed except the storm has gotten stronger. Notice how the convection has become ball-like. Very central, dense overcast right there. Winter now up to 80 miles an hour, and it's moving to the west-northwest at 7 miles an hour. You can see these very cold cloud tops measured at about 85 degrees below, below zero centigrade. What that means is that these thunderstorms are incredibly uh, intense, and they're lifting that cold, that moisture up into the air, and it's uh, overshooting into the stratosphere. And that means it is uh, very intense thunderstorm activity, and the storm is intensifying as it continues to move west-northwest. So the uh, consensus of the models, the ensemble models, continues to take it over to southeastern Louisiana. We throw away these, uh, uh, these outliers, if you will, and go with the consensus or the average and that would take it on over towards Morgan City and that's precisely what the Hurricane Center is doing. Hurricane warnings in effect for the northeastern tip of uh, let's see the Yucatan Peninsula, western tip of Cuba. This strengthens to 120 miles an hour, turns north and then goes to the northeast somewhere around uh, maybe Morgan City, Terrebonne Parish as we head towards Friday night well to our east. More on your forecast locally in just a few minutes. Well, we hope that forecast holds. Thank you, Patrick. Folks, keep the 12 News app handy to stay up to date on the track of Hurricane Delta. And remember to follow us on social media. 12 News is your hurricane headquarters.